certainly increased. A lot of people are suffering. I think it's gone much, much more expensive. Well, I'd say it hasn't changed. If I suppose anything to go back. Cost of travel, so petrol, or travel expenses if you look at buses or trains, they're much more expensive with the cost of petrol than diesel going up. The government get 83 per cent. Sometimes I'm disappointed, you know, things do go up eventually, even in Asda. Then food's much more expensive, even... Lakes have been frozen. Things that everybody's got to have. You've got to have food, electricity costs, water costs, rents, all of that sort of thing, it's all gone. Very, very expensive. It doesn't appear that we're getting a, a rise in wages or uh, benefits much at all. I think it's totally unfair. Well, it does because of all the bills that everybody has paid. Hey, your gas, as I said, your electric, your water, your council tax, all of those things have gone up and yet um, cost of living rises. I no longer just slip here and slip there. I have to make sure I have at least three places to go to because of the fuel situation. You know, people aren't getting cost of living rises or they're, they're not getting much extra money. I have to shop for bargains and I find that usually Asda comes up with the best prices. I'm not on the payroll, honestly. <laughs> so they're having to pay out more without having any extra income coming in. I think everybody's in the same boat. The bill's more than it was five years ago. Much more. I hope they do. I would hope they'll get better, but I can't see it. Well, I think for the next two to three years, we're going to still be in the recession. Things seem to be going up, as in bills and payments out, seem to be going up faster than money coming in. Um, it's very difficult, especially for young people, to get work, to get an income. I'm lucky that I work, but anybody that's on a fixed income, a pensioner, or somebody on income support um, that's not working on, on the dole, then it's extremely difficult for them. I can see that. A few more uh, pay rises for us. I honestly don't know because I work for a voluntary sector organisation and we're a charity and that particular sector is getting less funding so and it's a constant having to look for more funding so there is no security within that sector. Government are funding less or funding differently so it's a very uncertain future. We would hope that support stays here and work stays here but you never know. Well I do hope that in five years' time we are going to be out of the recession and we're going to be able to live a lot better and be able to probably afford a few luxuries. Well, it means I have to shop shrewdly. I go bargain hunting. I have a look around all the shops for the best prices.